Hello everyone, Jeff with The Green Review. Have you ever noticed your, with your cone flowers, your blanket flowers, the genus Echinacea or the genus Gallardia, that some of the flower heads suddenly kind of fall off? They, they just kind of bend over. There's a little chewed up mark here, but it's like, what in the world could cause this? Well, it turns out there's an insect called the head clipping weevil. Weevils are beetles with a snout. They have mouth parts at the end of the snout, kind of like having a mouth at the end of like an elephant's trunk. But these little guys are only a quarter of an inch long, so they're not you know, going to be causing too much trouble. What they do is they chew on the sides of one of these stems, the female does, and when she does that, it causes the flower head to fall over. And the weevils will mate on these flower heads, and the female will lay eggs in these flower heads, the flower heads will fall onto the ground, the larva will consume the flower, then the uh, larva will burrow into the ground for the winter, pupate, and next spring hatch back into an adult again. So there's only the one generation and it's kind of a, a long-term thing, and, but we don't want to lose all our flowers. So where are these weevils? It's, they're hard to find. They stay hidden away. But the easy thing to find is all these little flower heads falling over. So the thing to do is to take the flower heads and collect them and then dispose of them. And that will get rid of this generation of these uh, weevils. And so uh, whenever you see your plants starting to tip over like this, uh, go ahead and do some pruning, cut off the rest of the flower stalk, and the plant will continue uh, blooming and the rest of it will be fine. Um, it's hard to put insecticides on here because it, it, it's hard to find them and you don't know where they're at. Um, systemic insecticide, uh, one of the imidacloprid uh, products will uh, soak into the plant and work. Um, but there is a potential that people think that maybe that will uh, get into the flowers and maybe the pollen and maybe cause problems for bees. So in general we don't like to do that. Uh, whether it's uh, true or not, we just would rather uh, just go ahead and collect all these and eliminate the population for next year or reduce it down to a very small number. And so next time you're out you know, looking at your cone flowers, if you see some of these flower heads tipped over, you have head clipping weevils and it's time to do a little bit of cleanup. And this is Jeff for The Green Review. Thanks for watching.